What is up everybody, this is Derek, number one from Derek and Derek, and for those of you who are new to the videos, there is two Dereks on this channel, and the second Derek is not here because he's a huge nerd, and he doesn't play these kind of games. So, let me explain Warp Force in a very fashionable manner. Warp Force is obviously similar to Adventure Quest for those of you who don't know who Adventure Quest is. Adventure Quest is a turn-based game where you... Uh, you create a character and you develop its stats. You can be a warrior, a uh, mage, uh, what's the other one? Rogue. You can be you can you can be, you know, second tier classes of that, like so you can be pure warrior, but that's that's going off topic. And Warp Force, you I think you can be those kind of builds, but it really hasn't been established because the the levels are so small, like I'm a, I'm not I'm just a warp tracker, which is a free player, so I'm only seventy five, which I don't understand why they wouldn't just give you know, Guardians on Adventure Quest, Guardian on Warp Force, because it's an expansion, correct? So that's one problem I have with it. Uh, my second problem is that the game itself is not very good. Like, it doesn't have a very good combat system. It's similar to that of Adventure Quest, but at the same time, it's not as good. So, as you can tell, the interface is already way different. So, in this game, I believe you have, the like, it's called Gauntlets. Uh, you can use, uh, I think, battle suits, weapons, they change. This, uh, I got this from, uh, I believe, the, what is that called? The Critical Hits NPC I CD, I think. But, see, <laughs> see what I'm talking about? Uh, I don't know if, if it's just me, and I don't have the correct weapon or something. Uh... It's really hard to tell, but I'm not really big on this game for many reasons. It's completely different. It's built totally different than what we're used to if you play, you know, Adventure Quest. <laughs> There's not much to say about it. It's it's kind of a weak game. The you know the combat system's different. The stats, I think they do different things in this game. But, you know, I'm not one, I'm not really the right guy to tell you that, you know, this game is good or bad. If you like it, you know, that is, that's fine. But, uh, coming from a person that plays Adventure Quest, this probably should be worked on more. And the reason why I said that is because it kind of seems like they just forgot it. Uh, I might be wrong, but if, you know, they still update it, you let me know on my video. Because if you if you could see like the highest thing they have is 54, so you know. Anyway, this is Derek number one from Derek and Derek. Make sure to shoot us a subscribe. Uh, make sure to follow us on Twitter. Make sure to like us on Facebook. We really appreciate all the support you give us. If you guys didn't support us, we couldn't do this without you. Because you are the reason, the only reason why we keep going.